This week's boiler tip, we're taking another look at level controls. Last week we looked at the trough valve. One of the disadvantages to the trough valve is we can get de deterioration of that flange. So the next step, if we have that problem, is we can go to a bi-probe level control. We're going to take a look at that on the Parker because we've got a perfect example. So here's a really simple two-probe level control for a feed tank. So this is maintaining a minimum level in the tank and it's doing so with conductivity probes. The premise of a conductivity probe is we're sending voltage to the probe and we're seeing whether or not it's bridging to ground through the conductivity of the water. So the way that this operates is when the water is off the probes, um, this relay is calling for our solenoid to be on because we have no water. Um, water will fill and when we contact the top probe, the relay is going to shut off the water. Then when the water falls and comes off the bottom of the two probes, it's going to re-energize the relay. So this is quite simple, um, not hard to troubleshoot. And advantages, all of the connections are through the top of the tank, so we don't have flange deterioration. It's easy to retrofit. The downside is that it is on-off and where a trough valve will modulate the flow into the tank, this is all or nothing. So what we sometimes encounter with this is we'll have the tank cool um, when the fresh water's making up. So if we've got a tank with on-off feed water, a lot of times we'll use preheat or something to help maintain a steady tank temperature.